Welcome to newsletter 18. In the world of ZZ2, we are constantly striving to create opportunities for our employees to reach the highest level of their competency. How? By enabling our employees to use opportunities presented to them to create a meaningful future. By not enabling oneself, you are constantly living in exile. Let us investigate a bit more about enabling at ZZ2. Here's a soundbite of our CEO taken from his speech at the opening of Gestil in the Rubik Ves, explaining the power of enabling. Executive Mayor Tyson van Essen mentioned the job creation. Uh, Gestil now has 155 people employed, but what we don't count is the downstream jobs that's created by an enabler like Gistil. My calculation of the jobs created downstream uh, from the plants to the farm gate is a staggering 18,000 jobs. I think that's the part of the value that Gistil is going to bring to this region. A requirement for success is full enablement. Used this way, it's like yeast that gives rise to a whole enterprise. It is then that all participants contribute each in its own unique way to achieve goals and conquer challenges. At ZZ2, we believe in active programs for empowerment. But we also are convinced that self-empowerment is equally important. For self-empowerment, and empowerment to succeed, it's very important to have a holistic approach. Once the whole picture is visible, then meaning and a meaningful life is possible. And that brings the inspiration that we need to make of ZZ2 a success. Our inspiration at ZZ2 with empowered and self-empowered people is to be the benchmark of success in agriculture as a living open system creating value for all our stakeholders. With the open system approach we have, the focus is not on the self, but on the other. The focus is on the outside world rather than our inner circle. The relationships we try to foster is horizontal with all the people around us. And lastly, we accept change as an empowering tool, as an inevitable fact that can help us become better. The enabled person becomes an enabling force and thereby a multiplier of achievements. Such a person is Masipa Asermanju. He is today a manager at our award-winning Pinsgauer Stud. Since he took up this position, he has been involved in various activities within the cattle industry. Why did he choose cattle farming as a career? Of course, everyone will be surprised that why would you want uh, agriculture when it's a dirty job, when you can be all these agriculturalists, the engineers and whatnot. But to me, it was an inspiration, it was a passion that driving me to do it. To affirm someone is to connect him to the source of knowledge and skills that enables him to create his own opportunities. Asa, during his studies at university, spent his holidays working at ZZ2, gaining practical experience. This enabled him to improve his potential. Uh, as I was registered for the uh, BSc Agriculture, I had to do my practicals for the first day in 2012. And then I came here to ZZ2, they helped me to come here to ZZ2. Then after I came here, I saw my grades were improving because of what I've learned, what the experience I've acquired in ZZ2. Because as agriculture, you have to gain experience. You don't just read and read and read. So coming here ZZ2 really helped me and gave me an advantage over my colleagues in class because I was doing practicals and they were not doing practicals. For Asset to graduate was only the first step towards a higher ideal, to become an expert and a leader in his field. 
This is all good and well, but how does he plan to get there? Uh, during my study years, being here at ZZ2 and going back to school, it was, in, it, was, it was fascinating because now when the lecture is lecturing about animal handling or about uh, some dehoning or tattooing, or, then I can relate on that matters because I've done them during my practical. That is why I kept coming back every year so that I can improve my standards and my knowledge. You see, unlike other uh, careers, agriculture, you have to learn bit by bit, experience by experience going on forward. So right now my goal is to learn as much as possible from everyone in this industry, meaning a, 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 a laborer, a manager or a supervisor, I have to learn from them so that in future I can be able to be a manager and manage uh, the ZZ2 Cattle Livestock Division so that uh, then I will have acquired more knowledge from, from my working year. Asir is an excellent example of being able and being enabled. He is now enabling other youngsters interested in agriculture. He is a living example of multiplying achievements. Part of the success of ZZ2 is creating meaningful relationships. This is where ideas and knowledge is shared. One of the enabling tools in this respect is the Produce Marketing Association, the PMA, that brings like-minded people from across the entire food value chain together. This year, the PMA Fresh Connections Conference took place at the CSIR in Pretoria. Here's a visual presentation of just about anything new happening in the fruit and vegetable industry. This conference is a first step for many a young entrepreneur to be successful in this exciting career. Our CEO, who is the president of the South African leg of the PMA, gave the opening address. He affirmed the need to embrace change to reach full potential. I believe that uh, we are in the fresh produce industry as managers, mainly change managers. And the recipe for managing change uh, effectively is we have to think about the future and we have to think about the relationships to the outside of our own area. We have to think about the other. We have to think about developing uh, horizontal relationships. And we have to accept that uh, change is part of us. Now, where can you find a better partner to be your informer about how to manage change? If I think about the core value proposition of PMA, building networks globally, exposure to science and technology, leadership in terms of issues, and lastly, a very hot topic in South Africa, talent development. Now, from the CSIR International Convention Centre back to a tomato pack house at ZZ2. Annually, we produce in the region of 190,000 tons of produce. Being part of the team that keeps such a process running smoothly needs dedication and an enabled mind. Ian von Broerhaven is one of the young engineers. He has a very interesting story to tell how he became enabled for his contribution since a very young age. He is a second generation ZZ tour, following in the footsteps of his father. As an engineer, he is involved with various activities throughout the organization, providing him with an insight into various operations. He also did practical work at the company during his university holidays and has first-hand experience of the ZZ2 system. First of all, I think the foundation of uh, empowerment is to treat everybody with uh, respect. I was treated with respect and I want to respect everybody uh, or treat everybody respectfully. I think secondly ZZ2 uh, gives a lot of uh, opportunities to people 
Well, speaking from my past experience over the few years that I've been working with ZZ2, I can see how ZZ2 developed from an organization employing 6,500 people and that, that has grown to close to 10,000 people. And uh, also in ZZ2 there's a lot of uh, speciality opportunities, uh, employment opportunities for people to develop themselves in the field and acquire new skill sets to create uh, stakeholder value for uh, all of ZZ2 stakeholders not just within ZZ2, but over the whole of the Mpopo province and now the whole of the country as well. But the proof of the pudding lies in the eating, as the slogan says. At ZZ2, we have a very clear picture of our purpose. Our purpose is to provide our customers with the very best eating experience and that is why we market our produce in the best food magazines like Lampo Burakos. Take a look at this. Avos, mangoes, tomatoes, and that is our invite. Taste the experience. Why is agriculture a career forever? Because of food security. Feeding our nation is a top priority. That is why we say food health is our promise, healthy soil our passion. To fulfill our promise, we constantly enlarge the pool of agricultural talent by inviting students to visit our farms. Exposing the students to critical agricultural techniques and systems, ZZ2 is enabling future generations to take care of food security. These young people are only one example of various other groups that visit our farming operations. I started this newsletter by saying that at ZZ2 we constantly strive to create opportunities to enable our people to reach their highest level of competency. This needs constant intention and attention. A common sight at ZZ2 is leaders coming together to strategize about the way forward. What is our core assertion? To listen to each other and weigh priorities and find solutions to challenges. To be prepared, you must anticipate the unexpected. Asking questions. Above all, to have a holistic approach to achieve goals by creating opportunities. Even more important is your way of thinking. So, how does marketing enable ZZ2? In the ever-changing environment of choices and decisions, you need to be a clear and distinctive thinker, to have a constant, focused attention, a resilient frame of mind to withstand all challenges, an imaginative ambition to conquer the ever-changing marketing conditions. Thank you, it was great having you as our guest for the day. And now I'm going to enable myself with a salad so that I can experience the new invite, taste the experience. Mm -hmm.